Are you sick and tired of being sick and tired of this NoFap thing not working? Today, brother, I want to give you six amazing strategies that I learned over the years that allowed me to speed up my NoFap recovery in no time. Tip number five, tip number five, sorry, and number one are crucial. So if you want to speed up the recovery and live a life free of pee and fapping, this video is for you. The first secret, brother, that I want to share with you that changed my life forever is forget about the withdrawal symptoms. The big mistake I used to do that was making me miserable after I fap is the overthinking about the withdrawal symptoms. So I keep reading online on all those Reddit forums about withdrawals, 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 how to, how to stop these withdrawals. And I keep thinking about them all the time. So what ends up happening is I actually get withdrawals. When I stopped thinking about the withdrawal symptoms, what happened? I did not have any withdrawal symptoms at all. So don't make them a thing you think about all the time because if you do this what happens is you're gonna struggle a lot quitting thinking about withdrawal symptoms was one of the easiest way for me to recover super fast from fapping the second tip i want to give you brother is very important it's about eating as healthy as possible but making this a habit, don't eat a healthy meal and all of the rest is just fast food. But the tip I want to give you today, it's not about eating chicken, meat and stuff. We all know you need to eat a balanced diet, right? But what I want to give you today is a crucial tip that changed my life forever. Listen closely. I want you to only eat food that has no label on it, that has no ingredient list on it. Any food that you eat that has a label or it's packaged by a man, I don't want you to eat it at all. Don't eat that. Only eat your meat from your butcher, only eat your fruits from your local market, and only eat your vegetables from your local market as well. If someone is giving you something packaged with a label on it, with ingredients that you can't read, I want you to totally avoid that. When I started following this tip, my life changed forever and it was so easy for me to recover fast because I'm only putting the right nutrition in my body and real food on my body. Secret number three, get moving and specifically do squats, working out, especially doing compound exercises like squats is a game changer. It boosts your testosterone, it releases endorphins, and it helps you burn off that restless energy that might be otherwise led to cravings. Plus, the discipline you build in the gym carries over into other areas of your life. So go get those squats. They're more powerful than you think. And you know what is the best thing about working out? Is you're going to be consuming more food. You're going to be drinking more water. You're going to be sleeping better so there is a huge difference between someone that eats more meals and drinks more water what happens to the person eating more and drinking more and sleeping better they gonna recover faster they gonna recover faster from injuries and also from no fat no fat their no fat recovery gonna be faster than someone not working out so if you want to recover fast from your no fat just work out and do squats especially the other big secret that made it so easy for me to recover fast which helped me reduce my stress levels in a very noticeable way is less smartphone time we are all guilty of scrolling endlessly but too much screen time especially on social media can be a huge trigger Cut down on your smartphone use and you will find it much easier to focus on the things that really matter. Replace that screen time with activities that contribute to your growth. Read a book, learn something new, or just enjoy being in the moment. Brother, isolation and isolating yourself 
are your your worst enemy not only not only they make it so easy to crave watching pee and fab again but also when you are most of the time alone what's gonna happen your energy gets stuck and you're gonna become moody and full of anxiety and stress but you when you when you go out with your friends and enjoy a meal together or you drink a coffee or whatever you basically just socializing boost your energy and speeds up your nofab recovery i notice it when i am on nofab but i'm isolated it's it's so hard for me to 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 recover from from nofab but when i'm socializing and stuff it just it's just easy to recover you know it, it it makes life so much easier bro and finally secret six practice mindfulness and less thinking overthinking can drag you down and make your journey harder than it needs to be focus on staying present and being mindful of your thoughts and actions meditation deep breathing or even just taking a moment to appreciate your surroundings can work wonders when you stop overthinking and start living the now, everything becomes easier. And I, and I have noticed this in my personal life. It's like turning a switch on to life. You could be stressed, full of anxiety and depression. As soon as you start living in the moment, all those problems disappear and your life becomes so easy. So what I want you to do when you are in your bed, for example, in your room, just listen to, to the movements, listen to the sounds, the little sounds. Be present, totally present, because you can't be doing something and thinking about something else. Let's say you're washing your hands. You, could be, you can't be washing your hands and thinking about what, what you did yesterday. If you do this continually, you're gonna build anxiety in your brain. But if you just focus on the details and live li life in the moment and live in, with full presence, what happens? Your brain gonna be so relaxed and so happy. And brother, this is the best thing that ever happened to my life is mindfulness. When you do mindfulness, your life becomes easy. One thing that helps you become more mindful is meditation. Meditation makes it, makes it so easy to become present in your life. Brother, these are the six tips that make it so easy for me to speed up my nofap recovery. I hope uh, you're gonna use these tips because they changed my life and I'm sure they can change your life too. Okay, bro, so if you want to quit pee and fapping in less than one month, I want to share with you my other five secrets. Just watch this video here if you want to learn how to quit pee in less than one month. So I hope this video was useful to you. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next episode.